Floyd. We're joined by the 2012 Australian Open champion, Peter Senior. Pete, congratulations. Thank These you. are the beautiful clubs you did it with. Tell us about what you've got in your bag. Uh, well, pretty much all tight list. Um, I've got an Adams Rescue, which is uh, our new addition the last couple of years. I've never never used one, but uh, 17 degrees, but it comes in very handy. Once you get a bit older, it's pretty hard to hit the, the longer clubs. Um, and I've got the Rocker Ball 3 and, and Driver, but uh, everything else is tight list. Uh, I've been with Titleist for quite some time and uh, you know, the clubs have been great. Tell us about the putter, you've always fancied the longer version of the stick. Uh, started using the putter in 1988, uh, brought it back to Australia in the middle of 89, uh, won a few tournaments, a little bit of controversy there when, when I started to win a few events but uh, it's been in the bag. Uh, this is about the third or fourth variation that I've had of the long putter so uh, due to get rid of it shortly. Um, with the new rules coming in, but uh, no, it's been good. 88, so that next year you won your first Australian Open, 23 years between the two. Yeah, Who were you for your spring chicken when you won the first one? Jeez, 23. Um, yeah, it was a long, long time ago. We had a good field that year and uh, played at Kingston Heath and ended up winning by seven shots, so it was a, it was a nice, comfortable win. A little easier than last week. Beating the likes of Faldo and Kalkovecchia and Strain as well that year. Yeah, yeah, we had a, we had probably six of the top 15 guys in the world play that week, so... Uh, what know, else you got tucked away in here except the Australian Open trophy hidden away there somewhere? Um, no, pretty much just the normal stuff. I just put all my valuables in the front pocket here. I've got Jeez, my... Jeez, a bit extra weight in that I've got my wallet. I've got, I've got weekend, my little isn't wallet. There? <laughs> I've actually got the watch that I won last week. Ooh, nice. So, um, a nice little tag. Um, Was that number six or seven tag that you bought? Oh, no, no, it's uh, just come in nice because I wasn't wearing a watch up until then. This is a compartment where it's got nothing in it at the moment because I try and give my son a little bit of a, uh, uh, a rest during the practice days, but my wet weather gear and the bag cover. I've got a bag cover that goes over the whole, whole thing right. and that goes on there. Favourite club in, uh, there's one club to save your life, which is it? Uh, well, I tell you what, why I won last week, the 56 Vokey Wedge. Um, uh, that's the highest I've got. Guys can't believe that I haven't got a 58 or a 60 in the bag. What um, is it about that club? I, I probably chipped the best I've ever chipped last week. Um, you know, when the conditions are pretty tough, you chip it to four or five, maybe six feet, and you've still got a difficult putt across the breeze. Um, but I chipped it foot, two foot, nearly every time I had it. So uh, really took a lot of pressure off making pars last week. And how different was the celebration winning it as a 31-year-old as opposed to winning it as a 53-year-old? Uh, well, I've never been a drinker, so uh, I didn't celebrate back then. And last night we didn't get um, back to the hotel until quarter past ten. So, uh, you know, we just ordered room service and crashed. Congratulations on the win, mate. Thanks very much. Champion Thank again. You. Thanks for showing us around your bag, uh, Peter Senior. Thank you.